Hi boys and girls, this is our math class for Monday. Uh, we will have math every day this week. Um, trying to get through some fraction stuff so that it helps you with the testing. You won't have math until next week. Um, we are gonna be comparing fractions um, both in a model and on a number line. Okay, so let's take a look at my notes and then we'll go to IXL. You will have two, um, two skills to do. So this is O O or O point twelve. Okay, so they're going to show you a model. This is two fourths. This is twelve sixteenths. This has more filled in. It's got all of this area filled in. Whereas this only has half filled in. So this would be less than this one. Okay. Um, one twelfth and one fourth, we're comparing them. Which is bigger? One fourth. So we would say one twelfth is smaller or less than. You might want to copy these down. This means the first number is less than the second number. This means the first number is greater than the second number. Okay, so that's how you would do the O12. Now, O13, you're on number lines, okay? So graph one-third and two-thirds on the number line. So to do that, I put a dot here, and I'll show you how to do that on IXL. And then we put a dot here. Which number is smaller? This one, one-third, is closer to zero, so one-third would be smaller. The farther they get this way, the bigger they get, okay? <clears throat> Graph seven-eighths and five-eighths on the number line. So here's seven-eighths, here's five-eighths. Now, which is greater? Which one is closer to one? seven eighths is graph three halves and three fourths on the number line okay three fourths is easy it's right there okay now if i look at this okay i can see one half equals two fourths okay so this would be one half two or one, this would be two halves. So then this, two more fourths, this would be three halves, okay? Two fourths is a half, two fourths is our second half, two fourths is our third half. So which number is smaller? It would be three fourths, because it's, or yeah, three fourths, because it's closer to zero, okay? One fourth and two fourths. One fourth, two fourths. Those are easy to graph. These are a little more difficult when you get like that. Which number is smaller? Which one's closer to zero? If it's closer to zero, um, it's smaller. Okay. Graph five twelfths and five sixths. Five twelfths is easy, it's right there. Now let's look at five sixths. One, two, three, four, five. And if I take this down to the twelfths, it lines up right here. So that would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 12, so the same as 5, 6. So I go up here and put it at 10, 12. Is 5, 12 less than 5, 6? Or is 5, 12 greater than 5, 6? Here's 5, 12, so it's closer to 1, so it would be less than 5, 6. 7 fifths and 1 fifth. 1 fifth is easy, it's right there, and they do give us 7 fifths. Compare them. Is 7 fifths less than 1 fifth? Is it smaller than 1 fifth or is 7 fifths greater? 
seven fifths is close is past one. This is close to zero, so it would be seven fifths is greater than one fifth. Okay, and I do have one more on the back that is a little more difficult. Okay, five sixths and five thirds. Okay, so five sixths would be right here. Five thirds, that means that it's greater than one, because three thirds equals one. So this would be three thirds. Now let's look at this. Okay, thirds and sixths. Here's one third, that's worth two sixths. Okay, so here's one third. Here's two-thirds. Here's three-thirds. So two more sixths would be four-thirds. And then two more after that to here would be five-thirds. So 10 sixths equals 5 thirds. So is 5 sixths, this one right here, less than 5 thirds, or is it greater than 5 thirds? This is closer to zero, this is above one, so this is bigger. So we would say 5 sixths is less than 5 thirds. Let's look at IXL. You will do, O12 and O13, okay? So let's take a look. Whoop. Okay, on O12, you should be able to tell just by looking at it. This Okay, which is greater, which is covers, how much is shaded more? Two-fourths is shaded more than one-fourth. Okay, which one has less colored in? One-third. Two-eighths and seven-eighths, which one is, sorry, missed that, less. This one has less coloring, so two-eighths. Which fraction is greater? Which one has more colored in? Five sixths over three sixths. Which one is greater? They both only have one spot colored in, but this is an eighth and this is a fourth. This is a bigger space. Okay, uh, which is less? This goes all the way over here. This is only a half, so uh, which one has less? Four eighths. Which is greater? Which one has more colored in? Five sixths does. Which one is less? Whoops. Got to press on the number down there. Okay. Uh, which one is greater? This has more colored in. Okay, which one has less? That one. Okay, even looking at the numbers, these are both twelfths. Eight is less than ten. One half and one fourth, you can see that this is obviously greater. It has more colored in. Um, which one has less colored in? Two sixths. Okay, you have one twelfth and one third. Which one is greater? This one has a lot more colored in than one twelfth. Okay, nine tenths, nine twelfths, the same number colored in, but if we look at this, there's more white space here, so this has less colored in. Which one is greater? This one. Whoop. And so you keep going, okay? Um, then on 013, 
Whoops, I'm back at 012, sorry. <clears throat> okay, 013, they're gonna do just the way I did it, okay? Five sixths and one sixth. Here's one sixth. Here's five sixths. Okay? Which one is greater? Which one is farther away from zero? Five sixths. Okay? Four sixths and two sixths. Which one is smaller? This one is closer to zero. This space is smaller than this space. Three fifths and three tenths. Here's three tenths. If I look at this, three fifths, one, two, three, and go down to tenths, one, two, three, four, five, six. It's going to be at six tenths. So which one is smaller? Three tenths is closer to zero. Or, whoops, marked the wrong one. Three tenths. Okay. Seven tenths and four tenths. Which is smaller? Which one's closer to zero? Four tenths. Three twelfths and one twelfth. Which one is greater? Which one is, see, this is all the space it takes up, but three twelfths takes up that space. So that's greater. Three sixths and then three halves. Remember, one half is three sixths. So if I go one, two, three, that's one half. One, two, three, that's two halves. One, two, three, that's three halves. So is three sixths less than three halves? Is this one closer to zero than that one? Or is three sixths greater? Three sixths is less than. Seven twelfths um, and nine twelfths. Seven twelfths would be less than nine twelfths. Here's three thirds. Um, okay, one, two, three thirds would go to one, and then four thirds. Which one, or compare them? Four thirds is less than one, three thirds, or four thirds is greater. Four thirds is past one, so it's greater than three thirds. Five sixths, and then five thirds. Okay, on sixths, one third equals two sixths. Okay, so this would be one third, two thirds, three thirds four-thirds, five-thirds, okay? So, is five-sixths less than five-thirds? Here's five-sixths, here's five-thirds. It's less than, okay? Three-fifths and one-fifth. We compare them. Three-fifths is over here, it's higher, so it's greater than one-fifth. Two-thirds and two-sixths. Here's two-sixths. Remember, two, that's one-third. Two-thirds. Okay, and I can show that to you on here. Two-thirds equals one, two, three. Oops, sorry. One, two, three, four-sixths. Okay. So is two-thirds um, less than two-sixths or is two-thirds greater than two-sixths? Two-thirds is over here. It's more than two-thirds or two-sixths. Nine-fifths and eight-fifths. Okay, which one is farther away? Oh, now we have to write this. So nine slash five. My numbers aren't working. Nine slash five space is nine fifths greater or less than. It's farther away from one, so it's 
greater than space 8 slash 5. Okay? 5 sixths and 5 twelfths. There's 5 twelfths. 5 six would be right here. So if I go down here to the twelfths, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 twelfths. Okay, so is 5 sixths, that's 5 sixths right there, greater or less than 5 twelfths? It's farther away from 0, so it's greater than 5 slash 6 space. Um, then you click on the greater than 5 slash 12. Okay? And that's just how you do it for the rest of the time. So take your time and do a good job. Um, and have a great day. You do math 0 0.12 and 0 0.13.